Well, this one's like a plot out of Ocean's Eleven. Right now, police are searching for the man who managed to steal a half a million dollars in cash from an armored truck without even using a weapon. Yeah, this all went down in Greektown in broad daylight. 7 Action News reporter Kimberly Craig explains how this heist happened. A thief didn't even have to use a gun or wear a mask to walk away from this armored car with over a half a million dollars in cash. It happened around 8 o'clock this morning on Bobia near Monroe, just outside the Greektown Casino, where the Loomis armored car was parked making a stop. The good thing is that no one was hurt, and that's at this point, that's the most important thing, but we will continue our investigation um, to ascertain who's responsible and what happened. We're told the FBI and Detroit police are interviewing the driver of the Loomis armored car, and while it's early in the investigation, here's what sources are saying. The driver is supposed to remain behind the wheel at all times, and he's reportedly telling investigators that a man dressed like a fellow Loomis armored car worker prompted him to open up the vehicle. That man then grabbed bags of cash and simply walked off. Surveillance cameras inside the casino and around Greektown are now being looked at for clues. A source tells us the thief was seen walking east on foot toward 375, carrying those bags of cash. Anyone with any information is urged to call the FBI at 313-965-2323. As for the Loomis armored car, it was towed away by police to check for fingerprints or anything else that might lead them to a suspect. In downtown Detroit, Kimberly Craig, 7 Action News.